Welcome to another episode of Passionpreneur TV. Today I'm here with Jack Nicholson, the general manager at the Otter Co-op here in Alder Grove, and I'm so excited. Hi, Jack. Hi, how are you this morning? Good, good. You? Very good. Good. So the Otter Co-op started in 1922 by a bunch of local farmers in this area? In this area, yeah. Okay, and they wanted uh, buying power in regards to if they all got together and purchased feed and what other things? So stumping powder, that was one of the original items for Otter Co-op. We have a 50-year employee this year, Bev Dornan. Uh, she's our first Otter Co-op 50-year employee, and when she started, that was actually her job was to sell stumping powder. So oh my gosh. Pretty incredible. So we have 30, 35, 40, and this year is our first 50-year employee. In fact, we had to have a, the board come up with a special policy for a gift for a 50-year employee just because we've never had that before. No so doubt. that's fantastic. Fantastic. And I think that that really speaks to the culture of Otter Co-op, that it must be a great place to work as well as to shop if you stick around for 50 years. Absolutely, absolutely. And then how did it just grow and grow like this? Over so uh, members continue to need new services, and so as, the, as mem new members joined the co-op, uh, added new services such as the f uh, food, feed, gas bars. And then the profits that we make, our profits are your profits. So if you're a member of Otter Co-op, we distribute our profits at the end of the year back to our members, and it's based on how much you spent with the co-op. Very cool. And so when you buy gas, do you save on the gas or you just get... No, so you're the same price. We are the same price as everyone else. Same as our groceries. We're very competitive on our groceries, our hardware, our clothing. Same price, but we have cleaner facilities. We feel that we're more community-minded. Our profits stay right here in the community. So there is no head office in Texas or Toronto. All the money comes right back here to the community and back to our members. So for example, last year we made about $6 million. $4 million of that is going back to our members and the other two million gets reinvested into new services for our members. Absolutely. So tell me, what is it like to be a member? How do we become an Otter Co-op member? So it's called Lifetime Membership Benefits, so they're a one-time fee of $10. So you're buying $10 of shares into Otter Co-op. And so it's not a yearly fee like some of our competitors. One time you buy that, and then every year after that, as you're shopping at Otter Co-op and we make a profit, we share our profits back with you. So at the end of the year, if you shopped at the Co-op, we give a check back to you. Awesome. Or bought gas at any of the gas Correct. bars. Yeah. Awesome. Gas, feed, food, pharmacy. Fantastic. And you don't have to be a member to shop here. Absolutely not. Everyone's welcome to shop here. Enjoy our services. Stop by at the retail center. Stop by any of our gas bars. Anybody can shop here. But, you know, if you spend $300 in your first year, which is not very much, especially if you're buying gas, you'd be getting a check for more than that $10. And we discussed earlier, when you buy your $10, we give you coupons back for more than $10 more than value that. anyway. Yeah. yeah oh, One-time yeah. fee. I'm not walking out of here without my membership, and um, they sell shoes here too, so I'm getting in that area. Tell me more about the community-minded aspect of the Otter Co-op and what you guys do for local charities and uh, for yourselves here in the, in the parking lot. So some of our pillars are locally invested and community-minded. So in, in 2015, we donated over 300,000 of our profits back to local community groups. So some of the m m more major ones were the, we donated 75,000 to UFE for their agricultural program and the naming of the coal barn in Chilliwack. We also donated $70,000 through a partnership with Federated Co-op to the Delta Lions Annieville uh, Playground. Yeah. And then we sponsor a lot of uh, movie in the parks in Alder Grove. Most uh, if any of the arenas or baseball parks that you're in, you're going to see an Otter Co-op sign. We sponsor a lot of different community events. At our retail center here, we have a barbecue every Saturday and Sunday that's being run by a nonprofit group. So we supply the barbecue and propane for free. They get to take advantage of the 2,500 people that are coming to the site. Uh, we also supply the schools in Langley with a, a hot breakfast program for kids that have come to school without a meal. Mm -hmm. And we also sponsor backpacks full of food for kids going home on the weekend that don't necessarily have enough food to eat. So we have a very active kids club. We have over 2,500 children under the age of 12 in our kids club. You have all the qualities that I admire in a company, which are the giving back, the locally minded, supporting local. It's huge for you guys to be able to buy from local producers. Um, that's something that you guys specialize in or try to do, right? So absolutely. If you go through our produce department, a lot of our produce, we source it all as much as we can locally here so in store. Tell me a little bit more about the store. We did cover off uh, some of the different departments, but the bakery is a unique selling feature because you guys bake fresh. We bake fresh from scratch. The bakers are still measuring off the flour and sugar and salt and water that goes into that. Our meat cutters are also in store, so you can get custom roasts, custom steaks, custom sausages. We also have, we have a full deli downstairs that has everything that you need for hot meals or or ready to go meals. And a great restaurant, 399 breakfast. 399 breakfast, and you can get that that uh, breakfast all day. So that's a great draw to the Otter Co-op as well. 
you also provide educational opportunities. So for our, our team that works here, if you are a student going to high school, when you graduate after grade 12 and if you're going on to post-secondary school, we actually track their hours and we'll give them 25 cents an hour for every hour that they've worked for us while they were a student to put towards their post-secondary education. We also partner with the 4-H uh, groups and we give out eight $500 scholarships a year to 4-H students to go on to post-secondary education. And then we also have 10 $1,000 scholarships that are open to anybody. They have to have a... Uh, co-op membership, but they're open to anybody that's going on to post-secondary education as well, and those are given out every year. So cool. You must feel good about... It is. It's a great place to work. When we say we're community-minded, we work, live, and play here. And why do you love working here, personally? Personally, great people. We've got some great opportunities for our for our younger generation growing up, the great career opportunities. A lot of times people think, I'm not going to go work retail because I'm going to be a cashier. Well, I started out as a, as a frying donuts in Drumheller Co-op and I'm the general manager of one of the largest co-ops in Western Canada, so there's a lot of great uh, opportunities to grow and develop people, and that's the thing that I love about it, just being able to see our people succeed and take on bigger and better things. Unbelievably fantastic. It's fantastic. That's yeah. my great, that's my favorite word, fantastic. Fantastic, from Jack Nicholson. <laughs> All right, everybody, well, you know what to do. You need to come down to the Otter Co-op in Alder Grove and just see the difference. The minute you walk into the store, you'll feel it. You know you're at home here at the Otter Co-op. If you are an entrepreneur and you'd love to come on the show, please drop me a line. Otherwise, I encourage you to follow in your own heart's desire. Love your job. Love your life. And I'm Adara, and I dare you to make a difference.